So let's now solve some questions on this section. Which of the following is the correct list of triggers for maintenance testing? A component in production is modified, migrated, or retired. This is correct. In order to perform maintenance testing, our system should be in production. If we modify it or migrate it or retire it, in this case, we need maintenance testing. A fix has been received from a product that is in development. This is wrong because the product is in development. We are still developing the software, so in this case, there is no thing called maintenance testing. Regression has been discovered in a set of fixes just received from the developer. Here, we are performing testing and fixes of bugs are received from the developer. In this case, there is no maintenance testing. We are still developing and testing the product. A new requirement has been received for the software that is currently under test that may result in an architectural change. This is also wrong because our system is still under test. The first choice is the correct one. Which of the following is a treasure for maintenance testing? A new software product is being developed and defects have been found in unit testing. Here we are performing unit testing and we are still developing the software, so this is not maintenance. A new software product is being developed and will work across multiple platforms. Also here we are still developing the software, so this is not maintenance testing. A component of an existing production software product has been removed this is maintenance testing because this is a system in production and we removed a part of it which is called retirement so here we can say this is maintenance testing a component of an existing production software product has received high usage here our system is in production but this is not modification or migration or retirement this is only our system is live and many users use it this may or may not need maintenance testing. If this high usage leads to problems in performance, here we will need maintenance testing. But if everything is okay, we don't need any type of maintenance testing. So here, the correct answer is our component in production has been removed. Impact analysis helps us to decide what. What is the reason of using impact analysis? We said that impact analysis is performed to know the impact of our changes in order to know how much regression testing should we do.